everybody. Happy whatever day it is. I hope it's going great. I today wanted to try something new, as I do. Whoa, almost fell over. Haven't woken up yet. In one of my recent videos, I tried doing like an improv style juggling session to a song. I really loved that. If you haven't checked it out, you should go watch it. It's really fun. And I definitely want to do more like improv juggling, but something kind of related to that are sequences where you more like intentionally string together tricks to make like a little mini routine. I'm not very good at sequences. I tend to do one trick videos as you've seen, but I would really like to get better at sequences. So today I'm gonna try to make a sequence just from scratch. And I'm especially gonna try to get out of my comfort zone and do some moves that I don't normally do because I just don't wanna fall into those same habits. So I'm gonna push myself. We're gonna see how it goes. And of course you're gonna join me. Let's do it. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna try to make a sequence. I wanna push myself. I wanna do something different. So we'll see how that goes. Let's see, I'll start with like a multiplex. I do that a lot, but maybe I can end it in a weird way, like, or something. Ooh, I kind of like that. That's a good idea. One, no, how about one, two? That's different. No, what if I try to grab each of the balls at some point? One, two, three, no. One, two, three, no. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Nice. Six. Yeah, I kind of like the idea of throwing the one first because you just don't ever do that. <laughs> Where did the balls go? Where were we? Four, five. Except I want it to be fast, like that. One, two. So that kind of sets me up. Ah, that stupid throw. That sets me up for like a one-up, two-up variation or some sort of factory. Yeah, like that. But I don't like going into factories on my right hand, so can I do it the other way? No. Cool. Let's recap, I'm gonna forget. One, two, one, two, three, four. Juggling is hard. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, no. No, six, seven, six, seven. Really? Six, seven, eight. Yeah, six, seven, eight. It's hard to remember to go into the factory there. Here, boom. And then maybe like an actual juggle for a second. I feel like it would be good, like a good break. Yeah, I like that where it's like one, two, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Do that weird little throw. I learned that from Kyle Johnson. I'm not good at it. He's way better at it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <sighs> that part's the hardest. Six, seven, eight, nine. Ugh. Six, seven, eight, nine. Yes. Ten. I love it. This is this is fun. From the top. Ooh, I like that. So when I'm one, two, one, two, one, two. One. I swear I can juggle. this like cigar box thing and then I, I really want to do some juggling tricks not just clay motion tricks One. yeah ooh that's different I like the shape of that like that so right left left so here oh no I forgot oh yeah here that's kind of pretty Maybe I can go into a Mills messy thing because it feels like I should. Maybe a fake Mills mess for a couple. One, two. I need to throw my left hand there. 
Yes. So one, two, right, left, left. Right, left, left. Ooh, that's kind of cool. So from here, ooh, I like it. So we're here. Boom. That could be the end. One, two, three, four. Oh, let's see if I can remember the whole thing. No drops. One, two, three, no. Let's not drop anymore, okay? We talked about this. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. I totally forgot about that hard part. And then what? We did that. Oh, left, right, right. Like that. <sighs> Cannot remember all those pieces. I'm gonna take out this bit. I don't like the look of it in this. And since I'm over here after doing that, I think it would be better to start right into the, that. I'm gonna try to smooth it out just a little bit more, just on my own without the camera. And then I'm gonna go try to film it as a presentation of a pretty video with a nice depth of field and stuff. So I'll see you in a second, hopefully with a much smoother version of that. I changed my shirt because one, it's hot, and two, self-promotion. So, jugglingwarehouse.com. It's a good shirt. This way. I'm gonna come from this side. That's not right. I think it turned out pretty well. It looks like a white girl from Utah trying to look cool while juggling, but you know, I tried. I thought that that process was both harder and easier than I thought. It was easier to come up with variations than I thought it would be, but harder to actually make it work. Like it's so much harder to remember a string of tricks than it is to just do one trick really well. You know, I'm pretty new to that concept. I've only done a few juggling routines and most of them haven't been that intricate. So this was really fun for me and I really enjoyed it. If you wanna see the final, final video, head over to my Instagram. It's posted there right now. You can go like it and see it and it's pretty. What did you think of my final sequence? Was it semi good? Did you try following along? See if you could learn it as well. And I encourage you to make up your own sequences. And if you do, post them on Instagram and tag me at Taylor underscore tries. I want to see you all try stuff too. That was really fun and exhausting. Thank you all for watching. If you're not subscribed to me already, please consider doing that. It helps me out. And if you want to go the extra mile, you can go over to my Patreon and become a member of the Otter Club where you get extended tutorials and access to my slow motion catalog, which will include this entire sequence in slow motion. So if you want to go see that, that will be posted later this week and it's only $5 for all of the tricks and it helps me out. I hope you have a great week and I'll see you next time. It's getting hot. It was cold today, but now it's hot. Juggling. Nature's furnace.